What's up, y'all? I'm back again with another YouTube video. I hope y'all are having a blessed day. I am in the beautiful city of Huntsville right now, currently in my college town home. And yeah, college sucks. But um, I digress. I meant to say that because I've been wanting to animate so badly, but I haven't had time to animate because of homework. So I've been constantly saying, oh, I'm gonna work on this animated story for y'all. And I have the I have the voice recording already recorded. I just have not had time to draw for the story. So yeah, y'all please bear with me on that. That is coming out whenever I can get time to draw. So in the meantime, we're gonna be getting videos. Let me scoop back a little bit. I feel like I'm not in frame. Okay. So in the meantime, we're gonna get videos like this, like Q and A's, vlogs, things of that nature, just until I have time to animate. But guys, I promise you, I'm not done with animation. I promise, I'm not done with animated stories. I promise, I just don't have time to draw. So please bear with me. But the content still is gonna be fire. Um, it's still gonna be cool. It's still going to be entertaining, I should say. It's still going to be funny. You guys are still going to get an inside look on the shenanigans of my life because my life is like a movie slash TV show. It is hilarious. You guys will not be sorry. So stick with me, man. And if you're new, man, go ahead and hit that notification bell so that you know every time that I post. Hit that like button. And yeah, let's get into it. By the way, this is a Q&A video. I don't know if I said that before. Also... Another PS, I'm sorry. This is going to be the shortest Q&A video that you have probably seen on YouTube because I promoted it. I sent it out. I told everybody's mama now, and I got about, about four questions. <laughs> so yeah, this is gonna be funny. But I still appreciate everybody that sent the questions, you know, uh, and are interested in learning more about me. That is still very appreciated. And we're on the rise, man. I'm close to a thousand subs. and. I'm just excited to get there. So let's get into it. First question, we're gonna start off with Dami. She said, if I were to create my own cartoon, what would it be called and why? So if I were to create my own cartoon, I honestly don't know um, the title. It would just have to be something adventurous because I love anime, I love superheroes, I love stuff like that. Um, by the way, you probably saw that displayed in my previous animation, my very first animation I posted on YouTube, insert clip. And I proceed to throw I wind back. There you go. So yeah, um, clearly after seeing that clip, I'm heavily inspired by anime and just action and things of that nature. I love drama, I love things like that. Um, I watch Cartoon Network a lot. Um, and I love a lot of old, you know, Disney cartoons and things of that nature. I love classical Mickey Mouse and things of that nature. But yeah, I'm going on topic. It would probably something be adventurous. As of right now, something be adventurous. It would probably be something adventure related. There we go. Um, so in the meantime, Lonnie Tunes and his great adventures. I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, thank you. That is a very great question. The next question is coming from my nephew, Jacob. What's up, man? Love you. Thank you so much for the question. He said, what's my inspiration? So I kind of answered that in the last question, but my inspiration really is stemmed off of like great animators such as like, um, what's his name? He created the Fairly Odd Parents and um, a lot of famous cartoons on Nickelodeon, but um, Butch Hartman, that's his name. Butch Hartman, man, as a child, I used to love watching Fairly Odd Parents. And I even had a Fairly Odd Parents book, man, that I used to draw out of. I used to trace, I used to draw, I used to practice drawing, just looking at the uh, the book. And um, yeah, Butch Hartman was a huge inspiration for me getting into um, animation. And it was another animator, I forgot his name. But um, yeah, just watching a lot of different cartoons, man, that's really what's inspired me to really get into animation. Plus I've drawn since I was like, I don't even know how old I was, but I used to draw as a, like a child, man. I used to draw religiously, bro. I used to draw a lot. But yeah, I love you, man. Thank you for the question. Next! Next question is from my buddy, Mike Rizzo, man. Shout out Michael, man. If y'all haven't already, follow my boy Sub to him on YouTube, man. His content is amazing. It's hilarious, man. He does vlogs. 
anything you, you can think of, but he's hilarious and he's on the rise as well. But yeah, my boy Mike says, who's my role model? Well, right now my role model is my mom, uh, very hard working. I love her to death, man. She has just been exceptional, man, pushing through um, a lot of this hard time. Unfortunately, guys, if you don't know, my dad passed away when I was 17 years old. So uh, another huge role model um, that inspired me and just was a huge impact in my life, man. Beautiful man, beautiful man of God. I love him um, and I miss him. But yeah, he's another huge role model and another driving force behind me pursuing YouTube and TikTok and things of that nature. Just trying to really get my, my, my talent out there because I'm new to all of this, man. Um, and I was, I was honestly against it at first, but ever since this quarantine stuff happened, I was really just driven to say, hey man, you're talented, why not start it? And as dudes your age making a bunch of money off of animated stories and things of that nature. So I was like, why not me? So let's give it a try. So that's that's where my head was at. But yeah, that's my, that's my role model, man. Much love to you as well. Thank you for the question. Lastly, the last question. I told y'all this was gonna be quick. Um, comes from Andreas, one of my followers on TikTok, man. Awesome dude, thank you so much. One of, a huge supporter of mine. He said, when did I want to animate? Or when did I want to be an animator? Well, I wanted to be an animator um, when I figured out what the animation consisted of. <laughs> um, because I went to college at, initially as a major in graphic design, not knowing that graphic design had nothing to do with drawing. Graphic design deal with a lot, dealt with a lot of, I cannot talk today. Graphic design dealt with a lot of typography and image arrangement and things of that nature. Typography is like fonts and lettering, arrangement of letters, and making stuff look nice but it had nothing to do with drawing. So I did more research on what was more heavily based on drawing and I found out the animation was. It was in front of my face all my life. But uh, yeah, so after learning what animation was, when I transferred to Sam Houston, cause I initially went to uh, Mary Hart and Baylor. When I transferred to here to Sam Houston, I switched my major to animation and I haven't looked back since. And I've, I've loved every step of it. I'm very um, passionate about it. So yeah, and another part to this question, he said, have I gone viral yet? Yes, I've gone viral actually twice on TikTok already. Um, and I'm grateful, to, I'm grateful to God for it. Right now, speaking of TikTok, I am shadow banned and I am very frustrated about it. Not happy because if any, if anybody has seen my TikTok content, it's not inappropriate at all. I don't post anything inappropriate. Um, and God knows what else everybody else is posting, but I'm not getting into that. That'll be ranting. Long story short, I got Shadow Baron for posting an Elmo video. A video consisting of a little boy at his talent show singing a song about Elmo with an AK-47 in his hand. But yeah, I'm Shadow Baron. So my views have been boo-boo and I'm currently trying to work my way out of this shadow band and bring life back to my account. Cause I'm currently at 64, some thousand, 64.4 thousand followers. And I'm trying to keep growing. So if you're one of my TikTok followers and you're watching this YouTube video, and if you're somebody new and you have a TikTok or something, if you just want to support me in general, please show love to my TikTok account and help me get out of this shadow band. But yeah, man, that's all of the questions. Before I go, I just want to say, God bless you guys. I love you. Thank you for all of the love and support. We on the way up, man. I'm not looking back. I'm trying to be consistent and we're just going to make this a regular thing. I'm so excited, man. Uh, very pumped up for what the near future holds for me and my content and just, yeah, I feel good about it and I'm excited. You should be excited too, because you're a part of the journey, but yeah, man. Uh, if you haven't already, man, like I said before at the beginning of the video, hit that like button, man. Comment, let me know what you think. Talk to your boy. I do respond to comments. Also, man, um, hit that noti bell so you know every time that I post. Also, if you're new or if you're if you're an old, you know, subscriber, please check out my previous videos, man. They are hilarious in my opinion. 
my previous animated stories and my TikTok compilations, man. They are hilarious. You will not regret it. Once again, thank you. And yeah, tell your mama, tell your granny, tell everybody about my channel because we on the rise. You heard me? I know you heard me. I know you heard me. But yeah, man, I love y'all and thank you so much. Bye.